Life is not like a poker game. Players put down their money and take a chance at either winning the jackpots or losing their shirts. There is both an element of luck and skill involved, but essentially it all comes down to what you're willing to risk. In today's video we will cover some of the risks that everyone should take. Say no even if you don't know exactly what you don't want to do something. Work with a certain person or have a specific experience. Taking a risk in declining an opportunity builds character. At midlife it is time to realize that life is short and there is no time to waste on things that you don't feel good or right to you. Caring about someone else if you've ever gone through a bad breakup or dissolve a friendship, you just know exactly how heartbreaking it can be to care about someone else. But that shouldn't stop you from caring about another person. Letting another person get close to you and care about them deeply can be a scary thing. It will be so simple for them to break your trust and hurt you. But the beauty behind letting someone get close to you is that you get to know each other deeply and your bond together is tightly woven. That can be a great feeling. Learning and trying new things. There is always an element of risk when you're trying something new. Starting a new activity like rock climbing or surfing can be scary at first, but a large part of the fun is overcoming that fear. The same goes for big life changes. If you want to go to grad school or move to another part of the world, you have to just jump in and do it. It is impossible to do these incredible things without accepting a little bit of risk. Risk failing. Failing is the both the worst and best thing that can happen to you. When you don't fail, you succeed. When you do fail, you succeed at figuring out another way of not doing it. It just doesn't feel quite as good. We too often allow our emotions to get in the way of logic. If you don't risk failing, then you can't succeed. Success requires risking failure. That is true 100% of the time. risk putting it all on the line. If we do things right, there will be a time in our lives that we will have to decide whether or not we want to put it all on the line and roll the dice. My suggestion is to do so and to do so earlier on in life. The later you risk losing everything, the more difficult it will be to bounce back. The biggest rewards often require the largest risks. Just be smart about it and make sure you know exactly what you are risking and exactly what you will be getting as a reward. Go for the promotion. Far too few people get out of a career rut and actually roll up their sleeves to earn the promotion they're deserving of, says entrepreneur Tony Patio. And it isn't skill that's holding them back, but confidence. Risk not being good enough. There is always a chance that you won't be good enough, but again, isn't that something that you'd like to know? The fact is that you're either good enough or not good enough. 
Often when we think we are good enough, we actually aren't. Risk losing friendships Friendships can be great, but they can also be very restrictive. Following our dreams usually involves quite a bit of solitude. Friendships make it very difficult to take the time that you need to get the work done that needs to get done. In my opinion, true friends should support you in your dream no matter what. They should understand that you may have to distance yourself a bit more and then work together to keep the friendship alive, even if you don't see each other half as much. Following your passions and dreams How many people's dream have been squashed before they ever get off of the ground? It is sad, but true statesman that most people never take their dream past the planning stage. Everyone should follow their dreams no matter how unlikely they think it will happen. I started following my dreams because of a simple thought. When else am I going to do them? You can't wait for things to happen to you. And it is not as if you have another life waiting for you after you die. So the best thing to pursue your dreams will always be right now.